Don't say that. Can't be ashamed. Don't say that. <laughs> okay, that's it. It's a, it's a like happy set thing. So like happy that you know uh, we can share like seven. Uh, we can we can share this show. But again, uh, that means it's gonna end soon. But at the same time, we feel very accomplished. Ever since re uh, the release of So Bright until now, seven eight episodes. I, I would say it has exceeded our expectation. The timeline was really tight. The, the, the moment that we finished the song, we are literally left with about a week plus before the actual shoot. So we have to actually arrange time in between shoots for them to come back and practice while, while they're going on set and after that we finish with the event, they come back and practice. So it's extra time and effort invested from the yeah. actors. So on my end also, like, um, because we are we are so tight uh, on, on our timeline, Mo uh, like most of us, we have to take multiple roles uh, basically. I have to be the, the sound guy. Yeah. So the, after yeah. after his shit, he, he'll be in his character because I have quite a, quite a lot of scenes with yeah, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then uh, after his scene is done, and then he and will just the crew form. He will just. <laughs> because so basically, his, yeah. his character wears a headband. And then uh, when you see the headband, you know RT is here. And then the headband is off, then oh, okay, Bunch is back to his sound man. <laughs> <laughs> I have to be honest, you know, like recording has, uh, has been like, it's, it's something really tough because uh, it's not as easy as it seems. Everything is so detailed and, and, and the microphone catches every single noise you make. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, recording was tough for me. We, we yeah. would do takes like again and again and again. Yeah. Maybe just, uh, just trying to get it right. And then we would spend time in the office uh, like until uh, the wee hours, like, like 3, 4 a.m. Yeah, wee hours for you is okay already. Like, you know, have to, somebody have to stay back you know, and, <laughs> and correct everything that you say. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite, uh, if I were to pick from this tree, is actually this, um, this song called Zi Yao. Yeah, Zi Yao. Uh, it's, um, it's a rooftop scene. And then, uh, if you if people were to follow the story and all right, that that scene is actually to me it's a very meaningful scene and, and very uh, very emotional. Also. Yeah. Mine would be uh, I Dao Mo Ri. It's the last uh, the last song. Mm -hmm. It's uh, in the episode seven seven. So it's almost at the end. So it's a very sweet and kind of like a conclusion like how how is this two gonna like move on from there so you, when you look at the dance you will somehow know so your answer is so one fun no one song is written by me one song is written by one so <laughs> <laughs> each one take one <laughs> my opinion i've always said this like uh, i like the song Zia the most which is the rooftop scene that he mentioned because we actually spend almost one and a half month trying to recreate the starry sky and the moon literally one half month like day in day out kind like every day 12 hours in front of computer trying yeah. to key every frame yeah. trying to get it working yeah so our, our boy here was like tor being tortured by us basically like, every day he was here yeah so that particular scene actually we spent the most resources most time and effort in mm -hmm. i mean the song itself i, I really loved it uh at, at the very first point yeah. and with the, the visual effects everything i think that's one of the most significant uh, scene in the whole series. That I would say it's yeah. time well invested. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, yeah. It turned out to be a really good scene. Like, yeah, I mean, everyone can agree here. Yeah. So, like, yeah, for audience, if you haven't seen it, yeah, go watch it. Yeah, you should watch it, man. Yeah. Episode 5. Right? <laughs> yeah. Episode 5. Yeah, you can start from 1. 1. <laughs> <laughs>